Top of the morning, everybody. How's everybody doing? Rap session here. One half of the rap session. Burn notice. Here to do another um, cigar review. Told y'all I was gonna bring y'all as many as I can, um, as time permits. Um, hope everybody's staying safe, um, staying at home, taking the necessary, necessary precautions to keep you and your family safe. So hopefully we can fight this thing and it comes to a quick end. But uh, this morning, um, I got a very special cigar I'm gonna do a review on. This happens to be my favorite. When I say favorite, is my favorite cigar, hands down. Um, it is the Ave Maria Ark of the Covenant Gordo. This is a four and a half by 60 stick. Boom, 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 boom. This is my favorite cigar. This is probably the most um, complex cigar I have ever smoked. Um, yeah, so if you're thinking I'm gonna be a little biased this morning about this review, I definitely am. So <laughs> y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna get this bad boy lit up. Um, like I said, it is a four and a half by 60 stick. It is a Gordo. Um, the wrapper is from Ecuador. The filler is from um, Honduran and Nicaragua. And it is a full flavor, medium body cigar. So yeah, this thing, um, this thing has notes of cream, leather, earth. Um, I get a little bit of fruit out of there as well. Maybe that's just my palate, but yeah, I get some of everything. When I tell you this cigar takes you all over the place, it takes you all over the place. So yeah, the Ave Maria Ark of the Covenant, four and a half by 60 stick. I'm gonna get this bad boy lit up. Y'all stay tuned, I'll be back. What's up everybody, I'm back. Got this bad boy lit up. Boom, right off the top. Got a, a big blast of flavor, a lot of earth, a lot of leather right off top. Um, this cigar does take you through several transitions while you're smoking it, so um, you just gotta be patient with it, but you know, I promise you, you promise you're gonna thoroughly enjoy the cigar. If you ever get a chance to smoke one, the Ave Maria. Ark of the Covenant, four and a half by 60 Gordo stick. Yeah. Um, I pretty much know what this cigar is gonna do, but um, for ten, all intents and purposes for the cigar review, um, probably for the first third, you're gonna get a, a big blast of that leather and that earth. Then you're gonna see another transition. Um, so it's gonna kind of calm down a little bit. You're gonna get a little sweetness, a little mildness out of it. Um, then you're gonna get hit with that leather and that cream and that earth again. And it's just gonna be that that bounce back and forth um, all the way to the end. I smoke this cigar down, down to the end. Like I don't waste anything when I smoke this cigar. Um, but it's just that good um, for me. So yeah, if you ever get your uh, chance to get your hands on this, I got these, partic these particulars off of um, Cigar Bid. I try to buy them at least 10 to 15 at a time because they don't put them up on auction that, that often. So um, when they are on auction, I try to grab as many as I can and keep them in the humidor. I have a good amount in the humidor right now. Um, that's gonna last me a little while, but I smoke these every now and then. I haven't had one since last year sometime, probably, I don't know, September, October sometime. And I was going through my humidor this morning, seeing what I was going to do with V on, and I was like, what's up, girl? Ain't seen you in a while. So, yeah. But um, I was smoking the Ave Maria, uh, I want to say it was St. Charles, if I'm not mistaken, prior to smoking this. I kind of stumbled on this on accident. All of the Ave Maria, um, cigars are great cigars but um i like big cigars i like big sticks i like the gordo size i like the 60 gauges 58 or better um just my personal preference um but yeah i i love the ave maria brand always have um pretty good sticks so try them all see if you like them all uh, you might just like one or two 
Um, I happen to like them all. I have several of the Ave Maria line in the humidor, so yeah. This bad boy puts out a lot of smoke on its own as well. You can see the smoke almost coming out the wrapper. This is a excellent smoke right here. So I'm going to smoke this bad boy a little bit. Um, like I said, I already know the transitions and all that good stuff. And uh, got a good cup of Joe as usual to go with it. I'm going to enjoy that. Just trying to uh, pass the time here doing this uh, this quarantine. I've been watching uh, several series on Netflix. Watched the, uh, what is that, the Joe Tiger um, series yesterday. Pretty interesting. I've seen a lot of people talking about it and um, posting about it on Facebook and social media. So I was like, uh, I'm not one to watch uh, movies and series and stuff because everybody posts about it. But I was like, oh, I got some time on my hands. Let me check it out and see. And it was kind of pretty interesting um, how far people took uh, exotic animals and tigers and all that good stuff. So I'm not mad at it. I, I enjoyed it. Um, time well spent, I guess. So, yeah. Shout out to Cigar Slim, other half of the rap session. What up, man? We quarantine right now, but uh, we do have a podcast that's going to be dropping for y'all this evening. Y'all can see that on social media as well. We're going to have uh, Chef Bob on there, Chef Bo on there. Um, he's going to give us some breakdowns, all food secrets and all that stuff like that. This dude can burn, you hear me? So when we post him on Instagram, man, do yourself a favor and follow this guy. He's going to give y'all good, some good tips, tricks, recipes, secrets, and all that stuff. So y'all stay tuned for that podcast. But I'm going to get into this Ave Maria, Ark of the Covenant, Gordo. Y'all stay tuned. Smoke this down a little bit. I'll be right back at y'all. Welcome back, welcome back. Yeah, still into it. Ave Maria. Ark of the Covenant. Gordo. I normally would have a garage door open in the morning, but... It's super windy here this morning in Virginia. This bipolar weather is about 45, 50 degrees outside. It's not cold, but the wind is, is really hating right now. So I do got the side door open for some ventilation. Um, yeah, this VA weather, man, I don't know. 80 degrees two days in a row, then 50 degrees the next. I don't get it. You know, we'll get some consistency here soon, I guess. But, yeah. I'm a smoke regardless. But, yeah, I'm back into this Ave Maria, Ark of the Covenant. I uh, just want to give a shout-out to Hiram and Solomon Cigars, the high on high street. Hey, man, support y'all small businesses during this tough time. If you can get out and go some places, man, support y'all small businesses. Let's make sure they can, uh, we can help them keep their doors open um, at a minimum, you know. It's, it's tough out here and, and the little bit of money they talking about sending out to people. Don't get me wrong, it'll help in some areas, but they won't get the job done. So support your small businesses, help your neighbor out, help your friends out um, from a distance if you have to, but um, one of those times we all need to stick together and help each other out no matter what race political affiliation all that stuff go out the window so just be a blessing to somebody man if you're able to this for as long as I can. Like I said, I haven't smoked one of these in a really long time. So I'm going to enjoy this. I'm glad y'all tuning into the rap session. Like I said, we're getting back to the cigar reviews on YouTube um, as well as the podcast. So 
probably do a few more this week since I have some time on my hands. Um, I got one in mind already for tomorrow. I'm gonna hold off and tell you what it is. Um, but it's gonna be a Rocky Patel. It's gonna be a Rocky Patel. Um, I got a few of those in the humidor as well that I've been wanting to do a review on, so we'll do a review on the Rocky Patel tomorrow. Um, other than that, man, we just banging out these podcast episodes, and um, we had some stuff lined up to do um, in person, some events that was coming up, but all that's been put on hold. No big deal. We'll be back. Um, you can still catch us out in town if you're in the VA 757 area. You can catch us at Willie's up in Newport News. You can catch us at Emerson's in Hampton. You can catch us at the Smoke Shack over across the water in Norfolk, Virginia Beach. Or you can catch us at the most exclusive cigar lounge in the 757, the high members only over in Portsmouth, Virginia. So once all this stuff dies, dies down, we will be back around. So, But for the time being, YouTube, podcast thank god for social media other outlets that we can still bring y'all content on check out the instagram page like share post comment give us y'all feedback let us know what y'all want to see if y'all got a particular cigar that y'all want us to do a review on by all means put it down in the comments send us a dm however multiple ways to get a hold of us if y'all want to email us y'all can email us too the rap session at gmail.com if y'all got ideas our cigars y'all want us to try out if y'all have uh, accessories or anything like that y'all can send accessories in we'll do a review on them as well um the address is uh the rap session p.o box 5232 portsmouth virginia 23703 so y'all want to send some things in um there will be another giveaway coming real soon last week we gave away seven of the Hiram and solomon um cigars we gave away uh, one of each stick uh, to my man down in Florida who won those. Those just went out in the mail. So be looking for those. Um, I think this next uh, giveaway um, is just going to be just a grab bag of stuff. So you're going to get a whole array of cigars. We got some Gurkhas we need to give away. Uh, we got some ITCs, some Rocky Patels. I got some, plenty of diesels I need to give away. Um, what else I got? I got some AJ Fernandez. I got some, um, I don't know, I got a bunch of stuff. Uh, but yeah, it's probably gonna be, be a big grab bag, probably around 10 cigars. So y'all stay on the lookout for that. It's probably gonna be tomorrow that I'm, you know, we're gonna post, you know, the rules and the, you know, guidelines for winning. Um, the grad bag, so y'all stay tuned for that. Stay subscribed, turn your notifications on because a lot of people, after the, the giveaway is over, they say, We didn't know y'all was doing the giveaway. Why didn't y'all post it? We always post it. Turn your notifications on so you can see when the uh, giveaways happen, the contests, and all that stuff happen so you don't miss out. But yeah, this last contest, we got a good amount of DMs with people that were like, just, they weren't upset, but you know, they were kind of, man, we didn't know y'all was doing the giveaway, this, that, and the other, but turn your notifications on, man, and subscribe to the page, subscribe to the podcast, we put all that information out, Facebook page on the um, Rap Session Facebook page. When we post one thing, we post it to all the social media um, outlets. So turn your notifications on so you don't miss the giveaways. Um, we also got um, some cutters we need to send out. I know Cigar Slim got some stuff. Uh, he said he just got in. I'm not sure exactly what it is. And we're also giving away a Rap Session hat. So you never know what you're going to get in your bag, man, when you subscribe to the rap sessions, to the podcast, to the um, IG page. You never know what we're going to throw in the bag. So we just got a gang of these dual cutters in. 
that we're gonna throw in the bags. So we got some uh, rap session uh, cards and all that stuff like that. We're gonna throw in the bag, man. So subscribe, turn your notifications on. Don't miss out. And the next one it could be you. But yeah, this thing is transitioned a whole lot. Now it's on the sweeter side. I'm getting that little bit of taste of fruit in there. Uh, real creamy right now. It has died down a little bit as you know, you work your way up to the halfway point. And I'm gonna finish this bad boy off. I'm gonna smoke it down literally to the nub. Believe that. Um, enjoy this coffee. Um, hopefully this went down, I can die down, I can open up my door and enjoy the morning like I wanted to. But yeah, this has been the review on the Ave Maria Ark of Covenant four and a half by 60 Gordo stick. Um, gonna be posting the review on the Instagram page. Y'all check it out. Like I said, subscribe all to our social media at The Rap Session. Subscribe to the podcast. We're on Apple, Spotify, Google, uh, Radio Public, any podcast platform that's out there, we're on it. Subscribe to the podcast platform. Follow us. Turn your notifications on so you can win some of these cigars and some of this paraphernalia we want to um, pass out to our viewers and to our fans, man. We want to give back, show appreciation for y'all supporting us. In return, we want to support y'all. Um, this has been another review. Shout out to Cigar Slim, the other half of the rap session. Shout out to Frames, man. Frames been causing some problems out there with the last <laughs> podcast with about uh, LeBron James and all that. If y'all ain't listening to that podcast, go check that joint. Now, we're going to have Frame back on, back on to clarify his uh, position, too, once and for all. But, yeah. Appreciate y'all. Y'all have a wonderful day. Um, stay safe. Help somebody out, man. This is a rap session. We out. Peace.